Okay, great. Let's get ready to start playing a game. Um, I'm going to go back to the Vehicle Explore game. And first of all, it's reminding me that I need to pair the talkie player. So when I press the pair me, it automatically pairs. If it doesn't, tap the home tag on the back of the iPad. Okay, so Vehicle Explore. Excellent. All right, so I've got my child in there that I want to use. That's me, Annie. And I can see which items I've got. So particularly these are the vehicle items. If for instance, I um, had lost the helicopter, um, what I would do is just pop, see I slide that across and it'll take the helicopter out. Um, that's really important mainly in the hunt game so it doesn't ask to find something that's not there. Less important in the explore games. But very nifty because I often find that I misplace items or, you know, um, you know, Hayden's run off with something because he wants to use it and doesn't want Grace to use it. So this really helps um, prevent those arguments. Um, all right, I'm going to press start game. I've selected all my items. I'm ready to explore. What can you see? So I know when I've got that message from the talkie player um, that we're ready to play and explore. And then the next step for me to do, as it's prompting me to do on screen, is to tap the home tag that I've got sitting behind um, the iPad. And now it's ready. So I actually don't need the screen anymore um, because we're not meant to be on the screen. We've got to be away from it, get the best learning so I can be running around. I've got the um, vehicles just sitting here ready for me to explore, but I could have hidden these somewhere. I could be in the sand pit outside. I could be at the park anywhere that I wanted to be now because we're not connected on the internet anymore. This is all free roaming. Um, so the first one I'll pick is the car. I'm a car, I'm a car, I'm a car, I'm a car. Beep, beep. I'm a car, I'm a car, I'm a car, I'm a car. Beep, beep. And then I'll pick the bus. Bus. Great. So each of these um, in the Explore game will say four different things. They often will repeat the same thing. Um, and the idea is that repetition helps with the learning process. So when you hear it at least three times, it's more likely to sink into your memory. First of all, it's gonna to go to working memory and then we hope with enough playing relevance and repetition, we'll move that into long-term memory, which will improve language development. Let's see if it does says bus the next time or one of the other things. So that's the sound. <laughs> That's the bus horn and often children really like to get to the sound part um, because it's whimsical and so they'll often keep repeating until they'll get that one again. So repetition is not ideal for um, parents to hear but you'll be surprised that um, particularly children under five will be really happy to hear repetition and the same thing over and over. So as a bonus, it's given us that sound again. So this was the boat that I added earlier that wasn't part of the set and I added it and watch how it works. Boat. So it said boat, so it, it knows it's a boat and it's become part of the vehicle set. Um, so I could always hop down to the um, op shop and go and get myself a digger um, and then add that later and include it um, in the playset as well. So it just gives the flexibility with these extra tags to add on that you can keep adding to the set. You might even have, for instance, I have um, a big bus back here. Um, uh, these are really quite common to find at the op shop. Um, and so I can add this big bus to our set as well and have a small bus and a big bus. And as the parent, I can be saying, ooh, ooh, you know, small, big, you know, let's play with the big bus. Um, and, you know, have a little bit of fun because the big bus might fit, um, you know, uh, the little bus will fit inside the big bus. And so we might talk about things like that. Um, helicopter I love because it's got the whirly thing at the top. And that's got the sound of the helicopter. Great, well that's given us a taste of what the um, Vehicle Explore game would look like um, and how you could set it up to play it anywhere, outside, inside, 
um, and really, you know, you know, you're there to support, to add language, or if they're not ready for you to do that, to step back and watch and be ready for when they come back. So the last step they're going to do is go back to this iPad and find the home tag and tap that. And what this does is one, it's transferring the data across um, so that I know how they went and what they explored in that progress. And then um, what I'll know is that they, um, you know, ha have that point to come back to me as well. And we'll say, oh my goodness, did you know this is a helicopter? Uh, and they might not even say it correctly. And that doesn't matter because we're really going for the content, not the articulation. So the fact that they've been able to ident identify the rhythmic tone of how to say helicopter or gotten close and know that it's associated with this and the noise and maybe where you might find one is the next step. Um, that's a really important bridge and they'll want to share that with you. So be ready.